this is a warm-up exercise. Okay. And a warm-up exercise, we all should do it as soon as we wake up. Okay. <laughs> no, okay, not maybe as soon as we wake up. If it's not possible for as soon as you wake up, pick right now. Take a moment and pick a time when you're going to do this. It could be before breakfast, sometime in the morning. Yes. Before taking a shower, as soon as you wake up. What, some, some of us don't wake up very happy you know it's like the alarm yes. is going off all of those things so maybe not as soon as you wake up but at least when you're going into the shower when you're going into the bathroom when you're sitting down with your coffee when you are um, sitting down for breakfast some point pick up pick a time yes and um, I would like you to think of what you're grateful for three things you're grateful for and three different things in your life you're grateful for okay so one is um, a person you're grateful for. Okay. And the person could be living or not living. For example, you could be grateful for, let's say, um, like uh, Nelson Mandela. Okay. Right. You could be grateful for his incredible forgiveness. Mm -hmm. That he has shown how, she, he has shown the world how to forgive. Correct right and so you could be grateful for a quality that he has given you correct like forgiveness um, or so a person it mm -hmm. could be living also of course and so you're grateful for a person first yes you're grateful for a quality within yourself okay it could be courage it could be um, simplicity mm -hmm. it could be compassion a quality that you really feel embodies you very good. Okay. Okay. So person, quality, and then finally for me is God. Yes. That I am very grateful that he is present in my life. Very good. Okay. So that includes, that includes all of your attitude starts changing. Yes. Because it's more encompassing. Correct. Right. And so, um, and let's say when you're sitting down to, for breakfast, you forget. Um, you forget uh, that you t told yourself that before I sit down for breakfast, these are the three things I'm going to be grateful for. And they can change. You no know, person can change. The quality can change. God won't change in my life. But or the and first two can two. Cha change. But let's say I'm eating breakfast and after two or three bites, I remember, I forgot. Just get up. Stop eating your breakfast, get up, be grateful for, some, for those three things, and again, sit down. Very good. Okay? Perfect. So don't just eat, continue eating the breakfast because right. you have to change your attitude. So there has to be a consistent habit. Right. Very good. All right, let's Walk do a meditation. Through. Okay. Take a deep breath. And release that breath and be grateful for that breath. Take another deep breath. Release that breath. And be grateful that you're breathing. Take another deep breath, release that breath, and be grateful for the air. And now, take a moment and think of a person in your life that has inspired you or provided for you or just was there when you needed them. And just be grateful for that person right now. Just fill yourself with gratitude for that person being there in your life, for their quality, for their presence, Now, 
think of yourself. Think of your one of your eternal qualities. It could be courage or compassion or any other quality. I'm going to pick courage. And be grateful you have that quality. Be grateful to yourself. I am courageous and I'm grateful I'm courageous. And the last one is being grateful to a higher purpose, a higher power. I'm grateful I'm God's child. I'm ecstatic I'm God's child. Thank you, God. And it's not just me, all of us are God's children. But thank you for making this possible. And just fill yourself with these vibrations of gratitude. And with that thought, come back to the here and the now. Om Shanti, I am peace.